Okay, here is the finished lamp now. It is glazed in this greenish glaze, and we have all three pieces, the top part, the counterweight, which is filled with, with a metal granulate to make it really heavy. This, this counterpart um, uh, probably weighs th something about uh, one and a half kilos, between one and a half and two kilos, which it really needs um, to, to keep the lamp in, uh, in, the, in the level. And uh, here's this lamp holder goes over the lamp and the screws um, fix the lamp in here. Just put it on. Okay, and here it is, and you can adjust the lamp, and that's how it looks. The If you have a high ceiling, you of course need a longer cord. And this little lamp here, I sell for 100 and euros. Now I want to show how to make them. I'm making a lampshade now, a small one of these three lampshades I have in my shop. This is the, the one which has eventually 70, 27 centimeters in diameter when it's finished and I have to throw it on 31 centimeter of diameter so that's what I'm gonna do now I'm throwing on plastic bats so that I can lift up the lampshade after throwing it makes it a lot easier And uh, what I'm doing is, I'm not really throwing it from the very base as it looks when it's finished, but I'm throwing in, in two parts. So the base as it looks now is a lot wider than at the end. So after centering, I'm uh, throwing now this lampshade that does not have a bottom, it's like a big ring. And well, I want to try to get it to a 31 centimeter diameter, which is not, not really that difficult. It's 1,000 grams of clay. So I have to check, check the size, it says 30 centimeters already, so I'm almost there. And with this tool, I make the, the perfect shape from the outside, just simply straight as the classical lamps, lamp shades used to have. Got 31 centimeters. Okay, and that's it. The 
the water out in the middle. And then some plastic stripes. I cover the bottom so that it does not, that it stays wet and does not dry. Because I will need it later on. Here we are again uh, making the lampshades and um, I threw the lampshades a couple of hours before and then they stood on these bats for a couple of hours. You can see they are already a little bit whitish here but so they're quite stiff and now I can turn them around and turn this part so that they eventually look like this lampshade here. I want to have like a collar here because I have these lamp holders. They have three screws which go in there so it has to be uh, a little bit up, uh, going to the outside so that the screws will hold the lampshade eventually. And I'm going to show you how I make this now. Well, I have turned the lamps already on these bats. I put them on my, on my uh, wheel head and I have another bat with uh, a little bit of wet clay here so that I can center the, the top part without, uh, without uh, touching too much of the lamp. And now I take off the, the plastic band which is still there because I didn't want to have this part to dry so that I can throw now. Okay, then I cut this off here. And as you can see, it is, it is hollow here, quite thick and, and quite wet still. Okay, I start turning the wheel and first I have to center it and I, with a couple of couple of knocks, I center it and then I can start throwing. So I make this a bit wet again and uh, this just lies here on this bed, so there's not much friction. So I have to throw very carefully, and probably in between I have to center again. But right now it works quite fine. I do not need very much pressure in my hands because this is still very, very wet. So, so I throw just quite thin and before I can start bringing it in bringing it into the, the final form. You see the top rim is really very uneven, but I've got enough clay so I can just cut it off. With a needle, I cut off the top rim, makes it easier for me. So. bring it into the final shape and of course into the final size because these lamp holders have a, uh, a certain size it is must not be wider than six centimeters from the outside and uh, 
the inside has to be something around four and a half centimeters in diameter. I just check this. Yes, this is just six and four and a half, so this looks rather good. <laughs> 